What's up, everybody? Welcome. The wife, Brittany, and I are about to unload our second kiln ever. Is it our third? It's our third. You can say third out loud. All right, here it goes, guys. On the top, we got a plate. We know what the top holds for us. Okay, that's beautiful. Oh, yeah. Nice. It looks like wheat stock. Mm -hmm. This is your foot fingerprints, huh? Yep. That looks really good. Where's our, where's our stamp? Did you stamp it? On the side. Oh, you did, right there. There's a honeybee. Mm -hmm. There's a honeybee. All right, let's see what else we got here. I'm going to take this out and put it over here. Wow. Okay. Got a nice little lotus bowl right here. This thing turned out really nice. Good mm -hmm. color, huh? Ooh, no, a new tumbler. Look, it matches my matches my flannel. Is that the one our son did? No. Or did I do that one? Yeah. Or Frankie did it. <laughs> no, I mean glaze. I don't know if I glazed that one. Ooh, that's nice. It's pretty. I glazed that one. I remember. Good job. Looks good. Thank you. This is Isaiah. Our son glazed this one. He's seven years old. And he made it. He actually made that, yeah. So, mm. so these are, um, this is a mortar and pestle that I made. Wow, so look this how is clean the pestle. That and this is the unglazed mortar. I just, this is the actual clay called speckled buff. Wow, that looks good. And it's, there's no glaze on this. It's just, um, I wanted to try one just without the glaze. Yeah. It's really we're also, gorgeous. We're also curious. Uh, to see and, and learn, is it better for pestle and mortar with glaze or without? So if you guys know, tell us in the comments. This is another mortar. Mm -hmm. Here's another mortar right there. Oh, it came out really pretty. Mm -hmm. You can hear the pinging of the glass every now and then. Sounds like a wind chime or something. Oh, look at the drip down here. That's nice. Meant to be farms. I think you did that one because you did the little honeybee. Remember you wanted to paint it? Glaze it? The honeybee? No, I didn't. That one's not glaze. That's that's actually red clay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm stuck in the <laughs> thing of a bopper. Okay, next layer. Wow. No. Oh, your cactus actually looks like a cactus. Check it out. The cactus lives on. Now it looks like kind of like a Joshua tree, huh? <laughs> looks good though. I like it a lot. We got some cups here dang that color is beautiful all these pestles here there's a little shot glass yeah baby that looks good <laughs> yeah. let's get a rifle through this show the camera and then we'll put it put it in the basket these pestles actually look really cool looks like hardware you know that looks awesome it's all right it's kind of it's kind of <laughs> silly it was just a little test but now I know. Oh, uh, like that two-tone. Yeah. And then you got this little guy. This is brothers. Isaiah did this one. Your son made that cup and he glazed it himself. Yep, he actually put it through that on the wheel. Look at this one. Look at this one. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful. That's so pretty. That's just the um, really nice speckled buff clay with the white glaze. Yeah. The same one over here speckled in this lotus bowl. Really pokes mm-hmm. And here is one more thing that I didn't show out of the kiln, but here it is. I can't believe this was our third firing. And thank you guys so much for your support. We're at 350 subscribers now. We are getting there, guys. Only five months into this channel, so thank you for everything. Um, so much work goes into it, but so much we get out of it with the gratification of all the love we get from you guys. Thank you again for your support, and I'll see you tomorrow.